Hey guys, welcome to my video. So the start of 2020, I feel, has been all about bullet journals. At least that's what I've been seeing on YouTube a lot. So I decided to put my own spin on them. If you're the type who really likes to be creative with their journals, then I thought of a really cool idea to spruce up your goals list or any other page in your journal. Obviously, you may change the layout depending on your needs. Uh, I'm not using this specifically to write all my goals down. I have a separate list for that, but it was just an idea that I thought that you guys might enjoy. The supplies that I'm using today are linked in the description box. And in the meantime, I would really appreciate if you guys subscribed to my channel if you want to see more of these types of videos. So because I'm making a bullet journal page for goals, I felt like that was an appropriate topic to talk about today. I have, like I said, a separate list of goals that I created for 2020 that aren't shown in this video. And the major difference between my goals this year compared to past years is that they are actually achievable this year. However, I've found myself working probably averaging about 15 hours a day consistently for the last few weeks. And this is probably because I have a few side hustles that I, I, I don't like using that word, side hustle, but I just have financial goals that I want to achieve and in order to achieve them, I'm working extra jobs. So I do have three jobs that I work. And that means that if I want to achieve any of my personal development goals, I have to keep going long into the evening. And that's sort of how I came up with the 15 hours a day. Someone recently said that we hardly have hobbies anymore and that everything is a side hustle or a hustle of any kind and that we need time to just relax. And I completely agree with that. I, for example, have uh, climbing. I, I don't have any ulterior motive other than the fact that I enjoy moving my body while I'm climbing. Um, I'm not doing it to make money or anything like that. However, I think some people take it to the opposite extreme. For example, because I have goals, I make myself to-do lists every single day in order to quantifiably achieve those goals. It leaves me absolutely no time to spend on social media, but I feel the opposite is true for a lot of people. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like I have to be busy all the time in order to not procrastinate, but it also leaves me absolutely no time to do other things, those little things like watching an episode of one show, which we all need. We all need time to just decompress mentally. Anyways, one of my goals is to be consistent with my painting and upload regular YouTube videos. And so far I've been doing that consistently for about two and a half months ever since I started this channel. So if you guys got anything out of this video, I would really appreciate if you guys hit that like button. It really helps out the algorithm and therefore myself and my channel. All right, well, thank you so much for watching everyone and I hope you have a lovely day.